my god. Steps, what a fucking cock, my fuck. Oh my god, bro. <laughs> the ninja's coming for me. Okay, so what's up guys? Today I'm going to be showing you my settings to boost your frames. Uh, so I play on full screen borderless. You can either play on full screen or full screen borderless depending on what you like. You'll get a negative 10, maybe 15 FPS on borderless. But with two monitors it's a lot more efficient. It's easier for me to use. I do have a 3080 so a lot of the settings you may see will not probably be for you. Um, but I will recommend some settings for the lower tier graphics cards as well. Uh, I play on 100 render resolution, so 1920 by 1080. I have a 1080p monitor. Uh, my custom frame rate is unlimited. This boot gives me the maximum amount of FPS my computer can handle. Um, V-Sync off. Camera movement I have at 50%. This is a new setting they added with the new Caldera update. Honestly, 50% is probably the nicest for more for most of you. Uh, I don't really like having too much motion going on when I'm playing the game, so 50 is nice. Uh, 120 FOV unaffected, that really shouldn't change too much. Streaming quality is normal. Text resolution is normal. I would play on low when I used to have a 2060. Low is perfectly fine as well. This game really doesn't change from lo low to normal in looks wise uh always have your texture filter on high particle quality you can have on low if you're on a lower tier graphics card bullet and spray is enabled that won't do anything to your graphics uh gore effects enabled also the same filmic strength film grain dlsss and anti-aliasing i have all off and disabled that's just a personal thing you will lose more frames with anti-aliasing on but it will make it look more finished and smooth. I just don't like it looking blurry when I have Filmic SMA T2X on. It's not really the nicest looking one for me. So I play with it off. Motion blur off. Shadows, lighting, ray tracing all disabled. And then the cache spot, sun, and shadows are all enabled.
All right, so now I'm going to show you guys some Windows optimization settings that you can do for yourself. So first you're going to want to do is type in graphics settings. And you're going to want to have this off. I already have it off, but if you don't already have it off, turn it off. It will probably give you a bonus 10 FPS. Then next, what I want you to do is type in control panel. You're going to want to go to hardware and sound power options and select high performance if you do have something called ultimate performance as well that is also probably a better option so click on either one of those then next what i want you to do is open google chrome you're going to want to go to settings go to advanced system and turn this off so that way when you have Google Chrome closed, it's not going to be running background apps when you're playing COD or in the background of any other game.